All right, so real quick, this is my Steam Deck again. Uh, it's a giant mess. I've been busy there, busy there. Controllers and screens and broke a couple of screens. We had two screens. Tried to fix that the whole day, but it didn't work. Apparently, the plate where you have to get the VGA cable or the DVI uh, cable in there did not work anymore. Everything else did. Uh, so I stole the mouse of my wife's uh, computer upstairs and this is still a keyboard that I had uh, laying around. I'm trying to sell it actually but it didn't go. Uh, this is the Steam Deck right here. Um, it's been hooked up to this monitor that I Frankensteined with a different mount. It's really heavy but it's actually a monitor that I can watch my VHS tapes on as well if I need to backtrack. So. The Steam Deck is now connected with a USB-C hub, the U-Green, which you could have seen in the uh, previous video. It's at 4K60, but this is apparently, I think it's a 1080p monitor, I don't even know. I would have to look that up. It's a Sync Master 941, 941-941 MW Modern Warfare LCD TV Monitor. Really cool stuff. So I've been looking up my channel real quick because I'm using the Steam Deck now with Google Chrome that has it on there, which is pretty dope. So it's my face here and there. So I'm actually trying to get the, the other, other videos going. Let's see. Oh, and there's an ad. So I have to turn on the sound real quick. Doesn't really matter much, but whatever. Yeah, double data. Wow, 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 wee, wow. Skip ads, bro. All right, so. This is my intro. I'm gonna go full screen. Just check it out real quick. Uh, yeah, all right, so. We can just skip with the keyboard. So that all works. I do feel or kind of think that it has a little bit of frame drops here and there, but it's probably just the screen. It's not gonna be the Steam Deck, I think. I think the. Uh, it's the internet connection, YouTube, Google Chrome thing on the Steam Deck and probably a little bit this monitor as well. Sometimes it's even a little bit pixelated, but might be the video too. But anyway, it seems to work uh, really well. So what happens if we do this? Ah, we go back to Steam. Noise. Yeah. So we can press the escape button. There we go. We have Yuzu. And we've got Skater XL. We just downloaded Splinter Cell Blacklist because apparently that works. So what we're gonna do now is I'm gonna go over to my PC real quick. And I have this Xbox One controller that I picked up. Now I paired it with my PC, but let's see what happens if I just turn it on. I hope it's gonna be picked up by the Steam Deck. I don't think it's going to. Maybe I have to repair it because I had to go into desktop mode because apparently when you turn off Bluetooth in desktop mode, um, you turn it off here and it never goes on. So I did turn it on last time. So we're going to go over to Bluetooth. Yeah, there we go. Not connected. It's here. Connect. Not connected. See, I don't know why it's not connected. Um, oh, not connected. Come on, nah. The other thing is actually my TV, but it doesn't matter because normally, I don't even know how it has Bluetooth on. I normally always turn off Bluetooth. But this is really weird that it's not. Maybe I have to turn it off real quick. Five seconds or something, there you go. What if I turn it on again? And we go back to this one and we say connect. It's still doing this, not connected. It's so weird. It should work. Okay, so this is really weird. So what I have to do now is I, I maybe there's something that still needs to be picked up on the, um, on the whatchamacallit, on the the update. So we're going over to desktop. I'm gonna turn off the Xbox controller again. Just turning it off completely. Whoa! Didn't see this desktop before. That's new. But there's nothing here. <laughs> what? 
<laughs> that's super weird. Oh, wait. It turns on on here. That's absolutely crappy. I don't know why it does that. It has Bluetooth on, though. Let's up the brightness real quick. Oh, we can't because we're in desktop mode. So now I can go over with the mouse. See, I'm over here. Connect. So this is so weird. I do not know why this is. Of course it's not connected because it's not on, you idiots. What if I go now? And press connect again. And connection to device fails. Why? Okay, let's just do the pair button again. Do connect. Nope. That's really weird. I had it working before, but I don't know what's going on, man. Connect, come on. Can you connect? Shit buckets. Why you do this to me? Add new device. Let's just do add new device. That's again my TV. He's not going to find the... Um, the thingamajiggy, I think. The controller. Maybe I have to fucking boot it again. This is so annoying. It took a long time actually on the desktop as well to just find it. So again, we're gonna turn on the controller. Right, it's going. I'm gonna press the pair button. Now it starts flashing again. So now we're just gonna wait for it to do the scanning. Oh, man, um, if there are people watching this video and they know how to solve this whole thing, then please let me know. Also, I think it's very weird that I have this screen on desktop and not something else, not like this whole background that I have here and, you know, the icons of Yuzu and trash and all that stuff. I know I am trash. I know, I know. I mean, it's nothing new. Can we up the brightness here, please? We can see battery. There we go. Brightness. Thank you. Your notebook is configured not to sleep when closing the lid. What? This is not a, a, a notebook. What the fuck? That's so weird. Am I doing something wrong, people? Maybe I am. I need to open this one further. That's better. Bluetooth device wizard. Oh, I don't see like a don't seem like a wizard now. Can we just throw it away? All right, can we then search it again? Hello. Look, this is super interesting YouTube content, isn't it? There we go, we found it, peeps. There it is. Next, connecting to Xbox wireless controller. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Now, see, now it works. And as you can see, even... Oh, oh, come on. It's a little bit fidgety. Yeah. Okay, so the controller is pretty brand new, even though I bought it secondhand. But the dude said he only used it once or twice, and he went over to something else. But whatever. Um, so now what we can do is go back to game mode. We just use the mouse. God, it's such a... An amazing 1990s workstation, isn't it? And the only thing that's 2022 is the Steam Deck, and the rest is pretty much 1999 stuff. Damn, son. All right, so I can't cut this video because I'm on my phone. I'm too lazy to cut the video on the phone. Normally, I do stuff on the PC, which is also annoying. Got my aircon on, which is blasting in the back of my neck, so I'm probably, go probably going to be sick tomorrow. need to turn that off because too much aircon is not good. Oh, it's booting. Yep. There we go. Okay, so now... <laughs> now the controller works. So if I go, for example, to Skater XL, press the A button. I think it should load up, shouldn't it? Oh. A button. Play. All right, now I actually need to put my... Something... Wait, can I put something here? That my screen doesn't fall over. There you go. Perfect. Well, not perfect. 
not that perfect, but you know, we got the controller here. I'm just gonna play with it. We're at the primitive skate park. No, we're not the primitive skate park. Yeehaw! Still waiting for skate four. Oh, bleh. But yeah, uh, I mean, besides all of the uh, annoyingness. Oh, crap. Oof, that was ugly. Ah! No, hell no, that was super unrealistic. But yeah, the controller works really well. Um, not gonna lie. Lol. Oh, <laughs> straight into the trash. Ugh. I don't know how to do nose blunt slides or uh, blunt slides at all. I know how to do some flip tricks, but but that's about it. I mean, this game, uh, even though it's not a skate four, um, I really needed to get used to the controls. And um, yeah, well, you know, it's still a little bit difficult for me. I can just do basic stuff. Ah, so ugly. No. But you know, it's a really cool game though. I still wish Skate 4 was here. Oh, come on. Blech. Whoa. <laughs> so anyway, this works really well. Uh, I mean... It just works. It just works. It's great. I think there's a little bit of lag, but it's not that bad. So yeah, uh, I mean, I have to test this out further and um, I need to get my friends to buy a Steam Deck as well so we can use this to play some multiplayer games together because they either don't have money for a, a full PC build or have a decent PC build like I have, which sounds very arrogant, but I don't mean that in a bad way. It's just that I have built a PC when I was, uh, you know, two years younger and uh, I have the PC now for two years almost, I think. And, um, yeah, I got my uh, RTX 3080 and stuff like that, so... Whoa, that was weird. Crap. But, uh, yeah, I mean, this works really well. You can take this and, like, a portable monitor or something and a very small keyboard and a mouse and you can just go to your friends and have, like, little LAN parties and stuff like that because there's enough stuff that uh, runs on the... Uh, on the... Uh, Steam Deck itself, and on the monitor as well, so that's really cool. Ugh. So yeah, that's, uh, like I said, really cool. You can go back to the start button and just go exit game. And uh, yeah, I'm sorry for having um, to make this, like having, having made this little bit of a boring video, but this works really well. Um, I also put the, like I said, the audio into the back of the this monitor where we have sound. It's not that great because the um, Steam Deck is on full blast, I think. Yeah, it's on full blast. And this one right here is already on 90 right now. Oh, 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 oh boy, that was the controller right there, but it slid down my leg. Jesus Christ. Normally that never happens. 
But yeah, you can hear it. The sound is not that loud, but it's fine. You know, it works and it's a treat to you. So see you guys in the next video. Please leave a like and subscribe. And thanks for getting me past the 2,500 subs. <gasps> see you guys in the next one. Peace.